பார்ட் டூவில் நம்ம அந்த ஃபஸ்ட் லெக்சரில் ஒரே தடவை ஃபுல்லாக கொடுக்க வேண்டாம்னு சொல்லி தீம்ஸ்ன்னு சொல்லி செப்பரேட்டாக இப்போ வந்து ஒரு ஸ்டோரி படித்த பிறகு அதை எப்படி அனலைஸ் பண்ணணும் சொல்லி வி வில் ஹேவ் இன் திஸ் வீடியோ லெட் அஸ் சி ஹவு டு வி அனலைஸ் த ஸ்டோரி இப்போ இந்த மாதிரி ஸ்டோரிஸ் எல்லாம் படிக்கும்போது யூ ஹாவ் டு அனலைஸ் why this ability is required means you are going to write essays and for writing essays you require the breadth as well as depth of your subject we call it as t learning therefore depth irundalum breadth illana you will find it difficult பிரெத் இருந்து டெப்த் இல்லைனாலும் இட் வில் பி வெப்பல் டயரியான்னு சொல்லிடுவாங்க அதனால் லெட் அஸ் டேக் ஹவு யூ ஆர் கோயிங் டு அட்ரெஸ் திஸ் பை யூஸிங் தீஸ் திங்ஸ் ஊச் ஐ வில் டேக் இட் த்ரூ எ கோர்ஸ் இன் லாஜிக் ஹவு டு ரைட் யுவர் ஆர்டிகல்ஸ் லாஜிக்கலி அது பார்த்துட்டு இப்போ நவ் வி கோ டு த இப்போ இந்த ஸ்டோரி பார்த்தோம் இல்லையா இந்த ஸ்டோரியில் சிக்ஸ்டீன் பேஜஸ் நீங்கள் படித்த பிறகு முதல்ல தீம்ஸ் என்ன மேஜராக முன்வைக்கிறாரு ஃபஸ்ட்டு வந்து ஓல் ஃபேக்ட்ரி பெர்செப்ஷன் ரொம்ப இம்பார்ட்டண்ட்டு லீவிங் ஆல் த சோஷியல் இஷ்யூஸ் சிம்பாலிக் சிக்னிஃபிகன்ஸ் இருக்கா இல்லையான்னு பார்க்கறதுக்கு முன்னால் கோகுள் ஸ்டோரியில் இந்த ஓல் ஃபேக்ட்ரி பெர்செப்ஷன் வி ட்ரை டு அண்டர்ஸ்டாண்ட் த வேர்ல்ட் த்ரூ அவர் ஸ்மெல் சம்திங் வெரி சர்ப்ரைசிங் பிகாஸ் இஃப் யூ வாண்ட் டு சேஞ்ச் அன் ஆர்கனைசேஷன் ஒரு ஆர்கனைசேஷனல் கல்ச்சர் சேஞ்ச் பண்ணணும்னா சேஞ்ச் த ஸ்மெல்னு சொல்லுவாங்க தேர் ஃபோர் வாட் ஹேப்பன்ஸ் இஸ் தி நோஸ் is the most important part of anatomy of a human being and major kovalu have been influenced by this now one unfortunate thing is if you look at the african and in other continents you will find that the people will have big nose like i have and the people with big noses and all are likely to be misunderstood therefore in the idu vandu all factory perception o l f a all factory perception is what society and the class this is very important for you to understand now what happens is the entire society has been divided into various classes based on economic ability now what happens is once life in the society is based on which rank you belong in fact it is one the table of ranks have been solranga in the table of ranks under the enna from lowest position to the topmost position the king czar have created a table of ranks adu 14 ranks irukum in the 14 ranks liyo people will be moving from one place to the other without having any merit or even competence this is very important in the rank table of ranks and in edukku vandadna from feudalistic society feudalistic society where land owning classes were dominating the dominating the uh, country he created an another kind of society and class divisions in which people will be living with these divisions and each one will be 
will be trying to hold on to his own division. Now, what happens is, though it appears ridiculous when you are reading this story, what happens is, the major Kavaliyev, he thinks that by losing his nose, he lost everything. You can see here, in all the pictures, the noses of the people at the downward are all big, all, all not as beautiful as the king's nose. Therefore, you can definitely see this pyramid and the people, how they live in the society. No Russian nobility is basically based on this table of ranks. And what happens is people will be working through this particular thing and this entire thing called as noble educated bureaucrats. Now what happens is the king may not be making all the decisions, the entire thing is made by this set of bureaucrats and they are highly self-salving. Anna, what happened was, this was in 1762, this was abolished. In 1917, the entire ranks, everything were abolished and serfdom was also abolished in Russia and the, because these people were promoted for every seven years regardless of position or merit. In the Solom Bodhisam, our mind over our thoughts were there. Are we having the same kind of table of ranks in our country? Now, next theme on the identity. See, when the barber sees, when the barber sees this nose, he immediately identifies this nose belongs to uh, the person. How? Because he was so much involved in the job, he totally feels the skin, everything, therefore he is able to identify. And there is a lot of moving in the Kovelev. He is moving from one identity to the other. He is a minor official, but he acts very big. He wants to climb the table of rank and marry well, but without nose, he can neither marry nor he can climb the table because nose is an indicator of character of a person. Now let us take the role of supernatural or God. The nose goes to a church and it just goes and it prays in a church and then went this is absurdity. Now next one is style. It is actually precursor to magical realism. In the realism in a nerve, until 14th, 15th century we were having three genres of literary work. One is tragedy, number two is comedies. You have tragedies, comedies, and romantic novels. Romantic does not mean that it is only love. In fact, romantic means it is a good over bad. Therefore, at the beginning, there will be a good man and this good man will be prevented by a bad man and at the end, the good man prevails. This we call it as 
romantic literary churn now in the style enna na magical realism nu solvanga ninga idha padinge you just read it i will take a separate session on style and magical realism which will help you to understand the underlying ethical parts of life and russian literature in fact russian literature have influenced the thought process of most of the people gandhi ji was influenced by leo tolstoy's writing while leo tolstoy belongs to a rich rich family gogol is from a poor family therefore you will find the contrast between the writers in russian literature now one very important thing which i want to tell you is for people who would like to learn this entire thing in tamil you have ramakrishnan sir's videos i have given here please go through both the videos which talk about nikolai gogol and about nos i i passionately wish every one of you to do well in your ethics paper where i will be giving you notes which you can read and write your exam but by understanding these concepts you will be able to do a better practitioner of ethics beginning la sonna madre connecting the dots in the connecting the dots on the steve jobs sonar inna the connecting dots appadina avar vande ungalude success ku enna reason nu ketta bodhu he has told that when he was studying he could not study well but at that time he was studying the type setting type setting la padichittirundare when he was reading type setting which has the beautiful type setting therefore he says when the time is available use it well ungalku ethics romba pidichaduna tharava padinga spend every day half an hour eppadi ethics practice pannano solli she has given and i will also give you something on habit sharing if you have somebody in who is your neighbor or who is your friend who is sharing you do habit sharing about all these things i will talk in next class on deep work with this we go to the next class thank you ungalku ellarkume or important thing i want to share with you in the ias examination question paper la how the questions are designed questions vandu eda test pandradhukaga ungalukku kudukranga appdin solli namba tharava therinjikittona da you can write your answers nariya thadava and answers eludhi irupom but we never knew that that is not the right answer po adu enna nu paapoma now how questions are designed in park e eppadi nammude thinking process or question paathu unna eppadi adha patti yosikkirathu number 2 namba veetla eludumbodhu practice pannumbodhu eppadi eludurathu idu vandu inga practice pannala now modala vandu appraise argue assess attach choose compare estimate judge predict in the questions ku munna idu vandu appraise the proposal argue argue against the against a particular method of doing things let us say that argue in favor of supreme court judgment about not to inoculate persons compulsorily how will you argue therefore arrange define duplicate label list memorize in the madri kekkum bodu enna answer pannanum classify describe discuss explain in the madri kekkum bodu eppadi answer pannanum 
apply, choose, demonstrate. Now if you see almost all these things, you will find each one is different, each one requires a different kind of an answer. For example, in the fourth idala pathina illustrate nu irukum. Appo na you should give an example. Interpret na mele irukiradha vechi neenga interpret pannano solranga. Neenga idu ellame analyze pannano. Neenga question careful ah padikano. Appo dhaan you can write a right answer. Now learning is knowledge. Comprehension இது கொஞ்சம் உங்களுடைய ஓன் வேர்ட்ஸே அந் எழுதி பாருங்கள் லேர்னிங்னால் என்ன ஒரு ஆறு வேர்ட்ஸை நீங்கள் வந்து கொடுத்தீங்கன்னா இது நாலேஜா காம்ப்ரஹென்ஷனா என்ன ஏதுன்னு சொல்லி வர சே திங்க் பண்ண ஆரம்பிங்க நான் நீங்கள் யூஸ் பண்ணக்கூடிய இந்த கொஷின்ஸ் எல்லாமே ப்ளூம்ஸ் டெக்ஸானமின்னு ஒன்று இருக்கு வேர்ல்டில் எல்லாம் கொஷன் பேப்பர் செட்டர்ஸும் இப்படி தான் கொஷன் பேப்பர் ரெடி பண்ணுவாங்க பேசிக்காக கேட்கும்போது நாலேஜ் உங்களுக்கு தெரியுமா தெரியாதா டிஃபைன் எத்திக்ஸ் அப்படின்னு கேட்டாங்கன்னா தட் இஸ் ஹீஸ் டெஸ்டிங் த நாலேஜ் பேசிக் டெஃபினிஷன் ஆஃப் எத்திக்ஸ் யூ ஹேவ் டு கிவ் பட் ஹாவ் யூ அண்டர்ஸ்டுட் அப்படின்னு கேட்கும்போது வாட் இஸ் த டிஃப்ரென்ஸ் பிட்வீன் வேல்யூஸ் அண்ட் எத்திக்ஸ் this is your understanding and application in a particular case study i will share with you some 30 cases in a particular case study what kind of a ethical dilemma you face and how will you apply your knowledge application of ethical principles then analyze he don't say anything in this particular thing what is your analysis you are analyzing you analyze the thing and come out with a diagnosis of the problem for example a doctor what he does is he evaluates various parts of your body then comes out with a diagnosis if everything is good he says that you are good on the other hand if something is not good or malfunctioning then he will say a diagnosis this person is having that problem by using this particular medication or using this particular uh, uh, treatment he will be better then synthesize there are varied things different things are there you synthesize and be, give it in a form and ultimately evaluation that is reason why you evaluate for example you are an ias officer you evaluate whether this man deserves money or not you are giving old old age pension and when you are giving old age pension how whether this person requires old age pension or not for example he is not able to his thumb impression is not uh, you are not getting into that getting into the biometric medicine machine at that time evaluate this man is a old man we know his house he living and people with who are having who are in the hard work they will always have their thumbs cut and they will not be it is not be suitable therefore you evaluate and make a decision therefore knowledge understanding application analysis synthesis evaluation evaluation requires deepest form of thinking while knowledge requires basic basic aspects therefore knowledge is defined as a remembering of previously learned material idu vande specifically given by bloom neenga vande knowledge management adalla padikumbodu adu vera ivar kudukra definition base panni da namba exam la kepanga adanalu vande bloom solradhu padi previously learned material la enna enna neenga nyabam vechirkinga adanalu da neenga never you reread 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 that reread is meaningless what you have to do is you close your eyes after reading the reading the story or after reading the chapter then try to think what exactly is the author is going to give you information namba paathom illaya what are all the themes all factory and the all factory sensation is one of the themes 
தேர்ஃபோர் இந்த நாலு தீம்லேயும் நீங்கள் வந்து வாட் ஆர் ஆல் தி திங்ஸ் அப்படின்னு சொல்லி இந்த ஸ்டோரியை படிக்கணும் தேர்ஃபோர் நாலேஜ் இஸ் த பேசிக் அண்ட் ஒன்ஸ் யூ அண்டர்ஸ்டாண்ட் இட் தென் ஓன்லி யூ கேன் கோ டு த நெக்ஸ்ட் ஸ்டெப் அண்ட் இட் மே இன்வால்வ் த ரீகால் ஆஃப் வைட் ரேஞ்ச் ஆஃப் மெட்டீரியல் ஃப்ரம் ஸ்பெசிஃபிக் ஃபேக்ட்ஸ் டு கம்ப்ளீட் தியரிஸ் அண்ட் வாட் ஹேப்பன்ஸ் இஸ் வென் யூ ஆர் ஆஸ்ட் அபவுட் யுவர் நாலேஜ் யூ ஆர் டு பிரிங் ஸ்பெசிஃபிக் இன்ஃபர்மேஷன் ரொம்ப ஸ்பெசிஃபிக்காக இருக்கணும் நீங்கள் என்ன படித்தீங்களோ அது யூ ஹாவ் டு கிவ் இட் நோ நீங்கள் நாலேஜ்னா காமன் டேர்ம்ஸ் என்ன அப்படின்னு சொல்லி எத்திக்ஸ் வேல்யூஸ் அண்ட் குட் பேட் golden ratio like this various common terms that are used in your subject you should know thoroughly adanal da ninga enna pananona na or dictionary madri eludhi vechinga you should be a lexicographer ninga enna pananona na or dictionary madri eludhi adala a la varakudey terms ana b la varakudey terms ana thaniya eludhi vechinga adha vandu constant ah remember pannikinga na you will be able to do and no specific facts methods and procedures basic concepts and no principles and even in the knowledge when the almost you will you have to test yourself daily ninga padichita piragu idu eppadi varudhu idu eppadi how we can do it you will do it daily that is what is known as knowledge now comprehension or understanding it is the ability to grasp the meaning of the material therefore thani thaniya oru oru fact ah oru oru concept ah padichirundana it is of no use you may recall but you may not understand therefore what you have to do is you just combine these things difference between values and ethics i will give you a definite values is expanding while ethics while ethics is constraining values from the expanding universal love i reckon but adukku nu solli for example government you have to give all money free of cost to the people and that is not correct ethically what you have to do is you have to serve the people people who are paying taxes people who are unable to pay taxes all these things you have to see therefore values ethics values is expanding ethics puts a boundary on you idu vandu understanding now learning objective said this stage is verbal material and translate verbal material to mathematical formulae is very important thing therefore ethics is a function of ninga ellame indha maari eludittingna romba nalla irukum ethics is a function of the organization organization may be very ethical tata therefore even if a person wants to be unethical he cannot be unethical in a tata because organization is such a stringent ethics follower therefore it is a function of organization function of a person there are some people who will not be unethical and future consequences of the data therefore namba paakum bodu indha maadhiri irukkum bodu future la eppadi nadakkum and justifying methods and procedure in the method la dhaan namba study pandrom in the procedure dhaan use pandrom appdi paakalam application of ability to use learned material in new and concrete this is very important ipo ninga ethics paper la attitude la idu ellame ninga learn pannikiradhu ellame you have to use in new situations and new contexts you may not have undergone this at all கோவிட் நீங்கள் நைன்டீன் எயிட்டீனு முன்னால் படிச்சுருந்தீங்கன்னா கோவிட் பற்றி தெரிஞ்சே இருக்கிற தெரிகிறதுக்கு வாய்ப்பே இல்லை அந்த கோவிட்டில் நம்ம எப்படி எத்திக்கலாக இருக்கணும் அப்படின்னு சொல்லி யூ ஹாவ் டு அப்ளை தட் இஸ் அப்ளிகேஷன் ஆஃப் நாலேஜ் ரூல்ஸ் மெத்தட்ஸ் கான்செப்ட்ஸ் ப்ரின்ஸிபல்ஸ் லாஸ் அண்ட் தியரிஸ் கம்மிங் டு திஸ் நெக்ஸ்ட் 
ஹையர் லெவல் ஆஃப் அண்டர்ஸ்டாண்டிங் உங்களுக்கு நல்லா அண்டர்ஸ்டாண்ட் பண்ணி அது வந்து எந்தெந்த ஏரியாவில் அப்ளை பண்ணணும் எந்தெந்த நியூ ஏரியாவில் வரும் அப்படின்னு திங்க் பண்ணுறது தான் அப்ளிகேஷன் நெக்ஸ்ட் apply laws and theories to practical situation many of the theories what you will study which i will when we are discussing the various theories we should know how to apply these theories and analysis refers to the ability to break down material into component parts identification of parts analysis of relationship between the parts and recognition of organizational principle idu ye idella group pannirukom ipo neenga oru dog ah eduthukittumna idu oru 5000 idu oru 50000 years dog irundaduna dog kedave adu andha kaalathil irundhadhu vandu onai da irundhadhu therefore you when you are studying this you have to clearly understand how it has come up to this level and what it was before idha namba paakrom neenga paathina indha maari identification of parts analysis material into component parts then how it was organized indha maari dhaan namba analyze pannom analysis content and structural form of the material idhula enna irukku content enna irukku நம்ம எஸ்எஸ் எழுதும் போது யூ ஹாட் பி வெரி வெரி கேர்ஃபுல் இன் ரைட்டிங் த கண்டென்ட் வெரி கிளியர்லி நமக்கு தெரிஞ்சது எல்லாமே எழுதக்கூடாது இஸ் இட் ஹேவிங் எ ஸ்ட்ரக்சர் இப்போ வந்து நம்ம ஒரு ரிசர்ச் ரிப்போர்ட் மெடிக்கலில் எழுதணும்னா ஐஎம்ஆர்டி ஸ்ட்ரக்சர் இருக்கு ஐனா இன்ட்ரடக்ஷன் மெத்தட்ஸ் தென் ரிசல்ட்ஸ் அண்ட் டிஸ்கஷன் therefore idhil enna content introduction la varadhu adutha idhil varakudadhu therefore content and form therefore neenga essays eludumbodhu content enna irukkanum form enna irukkanum for example we will discuss thesis of professor raghuram rajan who whose thesis is essays in banking adha oru thesis he wrote essays on banking and he did his phd from one of the best universities in us idu vandu eppadi oru essays nu eludraaru and the essays la enna content irundhadu endha structure irundhadu nam paakalam now recognize unstated assumptions nariya assumptions ellam pannirukom logical fallacies edhaav irukka nu paakalam what is the logical fallacy that we undertake while doing writing a article article edavadhu namu vandu or essay eludumbodhu there is a logical fallacy irukka what we accepted at the beginning we contradict in the middle and at the end we try to try to give out some other kind of a thing anala ninga eludumbodhu logical fallacies facts and inferences and there are some people opinions kodupanga it is opinion but not inference inference vandha the data la irund edukirathu facts and the actually what has happened therefore this is how you have to do especially at this stage synthesis idu vandu analysis idu vandu synthesis ability to put parts together to form a new whole unique communication theme or speech நம்ம படித்தோம் இல்லையா ஞாபகம் இருக்கா அவர் என்ன சொல்கிறாங்கன்னா இது வந்து மேஜிக்கல் ரியலிசம் ரியலிசம்னா ஆக்சுவலாக என்ன நடக்குதுன்னு சொல்லி எழுதது ரியலிசம் மேஜிக்கல் ரியலிசம்னா சம்திங் பியாண்ட் தேட் தேர் ஃபார் ரிசர்ச் ப்ரப்போசல் செட் ஆஃப் அப்ஸ்ட்ராக்ட் ரிலேஷன்ஸ் வென் யூ ஆர் டூ ஒர்க்கிங் ஆஸ் அன் ஐஏஎஸ் ஆஃபீஸர் யூ வில் பி ஆஸ் டு ப்ரொவைட் லாட் ஆஃப் ப்ராஜெக்ட் ரிப்போர்ட்ஸ் இதில் வந்து லாட் ஆஃப் சிந்தசிஸ் இஸ் ரெக்வைர்ட் this is tested by your writing ability in your in your uh, in your essay writing in this area creative behavior and formulation of new patterns or structure is expected when you are writing synthesis write well organized theme 
speech, creative story, experimentation, these are all the things you have to use. Now, evaluation. It is the ability to judge the material for a given purpose. The judgments are to be based on definite criteria. It is internal criteria and external criteria, what others are expecting from you and what you are expecting from within your organization. These are the materials. And cognitive, it is the highest form of cognitive hierarchy. Cognition of Dinsunamana, it is the knowingness, cognition, understanding. Therefore, conscious value judgments based on clearly defined criteria. Now, what is the Jerome Bantham? Theory is said at the class la padika poro in ethics. You were no sooner than maximum good to maximum people of this honor. Okay. Now, if you take cigarette smoking, it's bad for people. Then government can ban it. But government gets a tax on that. Therefore, they always have advertisement telling that tobacco is bad for your health. But at the same time, they, therefore, it is a value judgment. You have to give a value judgment. Therefore, maximum good to maximum people under Jerome Bantham would idea, yepudi namba vande use panala in our day to day life under the, we will see. But this is the learning outcome. Now, judge your logical consistency of written material. The learning or umba carefula namba yorudum bodi. This is the finest way of writing essays. Now, which are the author of Das Capital? You know that it is written by Marx. And you can definitely see here various questions here. This is the answer to the question. What is the formula for this? 4 pi r cube by 3 is a knowledge comprehension. Therefore, you can write various, you can definitely see here various, or simple case study for you to understand. You can definitely go through, I have also given the answer. You have to tell me why fourth is the correct answer. Now, similarly, again, fourth is the answer. Seventh is, you will see answer seven. Uh, therefore, different levels of cognitive abilities are being tested in your examination. So you have to do this and I wish you all the best. We will see in the tomorrow's class. Thank you very much.